good morning. You might hear doggy feet running around. I got Barton in my lap and Sophie in my lap, but I'm going to try to read you a book this morning because I am very behind. Um, sorry that I look this way, but um, there's not a lot of sleep going on <laughs> around here these days. So, um, anyway, this morning I wanted to read Families, Families, Families to You. It's one of my favorite books. Um, and it's by Suzanne Lang and Max Lang. So I wanna read that story to you this morning. Families, families, families. This book was written for Lulu. Some children have lots of siblings. That is a lot of brothers and sisters. Some children have none, like me. I'm an only child. Some children have two dads. Some have one mom. Children live with their grandparents. And some live with an aunt. Some children have many pets. And some just have a plant. Some children live with their father. Some have two mothers, like my little boy. Some children are adopted. Some have stepsisters and brothers. Some children bunk with their cousins. Some have a mom and a pop. Some children's parents are married. Some children's parents are not, and that's okay. No matter if you have a ma, a pa, a hog, this llama, 10 frogs, and a slug, and a cousin named Doug, a great grandma Betty and a great aunt Sue, Uncle Hal, Al, and Sal, and Uncle Lou too. One step sis, three step bros, two step moms, and a prize winning rose, a robot butler to serve you tea, the world's biggest grandpa, or whatever it may be, it might be. If you love each other, then you are a family. 